Hi friends, welcome back to the channel, SciTech. In this one, I'm going to do the CPU torting test in the Redmi Note 12 Turbo device, which has got the Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 processor by using with the high performance mode. So this is the world's first Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 processor. And previously, I did upload the video without using any kind of high performance mode while doing the CPU totaling test. But today, I'm going to do that test using with the high performance mode. Since a lot of users, they did request me to upload a video using the high performance mode. And now we're gonna find out exactly the CPU totaling graph, how it actually gonna look like after the uses of high performance mode and this is a graph without using any kind of high performance mode as you can see without using any high performance mode this is how the graph looks like so right now i'm going to clear everything from the background and now i'm going to do the cp totaling test so using with the same settings in case if you want to know more details about this device so make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and also don't forget to follow my channel and try to check the playlist videos of the redmi note 12 turbo there you can actually find all the information in one single playlist all the links are provided in the description below so now let's get started with the cpu throttling, throttling test in this redmi note 12 turbo device Right now, as you can see, friends, after getting close to 6 minutes of time, so using with the high performance mode, so this is the temperature is 38 degrees Celsius, and you can see the graph how it actually looks like. So, by the end of the test, we are going to compare so with high performance mode and without high performance mode, how much it's impacting in this Redmi Note 12 Turbo device with the Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 processor. And I'm going to be back after some time, maybe after 12 and 30 minutes of time. So final friends is this how the graph looks like after the using the high performance mode and the temperature did increase up to 40 degrees Celsius and the CPU total up to 69 percentage and without using high performance mode this is a graph and with using high performance mode this is how the graph looks like. In both scenarios I did observe the same kind of uh, throttling is there at the end as you can see and same kind of high benchmark scores exactly very similar benchmarks I did see regarding the performance. So overall in this Redmi uh, Note 12 Turbo device that's something pretty sure that even if you use high performance mode and without using high performance mode the performance will not impact much I mean it's still the same thing as you can see friends that's something you should know about regarding the overall performance and the temperature also remains to be exactly 40 degrees Celsius in two scenarios 40 degrees and 40 degrees and meanwhile signing off friends thank you for watching this is a quick information about the Snapdragon 7 Plus uh, Gen 2 processor what you should know about maybe next time I'll try to use, add the CPU totaling test application in the game turbo and then I'll try to do the test again but meanwhile signing off friends thank you for watching and then stay tuned for more updates and bye